feel the force. Hello everyone, I just put on pajamas. I was so chilly walking home with vegan gelato, but I thought I would talk to you. I don't think I talked to you so that I can wrap up the video. I've been editing very early and letting it go. And it usually is not finished by the time I go to bed. And I just have to hope that it makes it. But anyway, turned out to be quite a busy day. I'll just try and go down it all. We walked to a donut place thinking we needed cash only. So like I gave all the cash I had in my wallet to Danny and then we made our order and we we're like $4 short. And then she's like, do you just want to use card? <laughs> we're like, we didn't know we could. So yeah, we had that and it was fine. I got a blueberry donut and it tasted about like a Dunkin' Donut, blueberry donut. And I had an egg sandwich and their bagel was very weird. It was like a roll, not very bagely, but it was still good and I still ate it. And then we headed back and we had a little time. So I just sat outside drawing until Danny and Sebastian got me for a walk. <clears throat> and we walked to a park by the ocean and then back again. We had to get back in time to get in the car and drive to pick up Nana from her retirement village. And we brought her back to Oceanside for lunch. That was wonderful. We get to see her one more time tomorrow when we have a family dinner. And then we took her back and we were going to come back here and get our stuff all set to go to the tide pools, like hiking boots, hoodies and stuff. We were going to do tide pools and then dinner and then home, but we were short on time. We needed to get there at low tide, so we headed straight from Nana's to the beach and Danny was like, well, we'll just go in this surf, surf shop. Sebastian didn't have his hat for outside because we thought we were coming back and Danny didn't have any long sleeves. I ended up getting this just because it was on sale and Danny picked it out. So I'm not going to say no to a beanie. I love me beanies, but yeah, they got hoodies and <laughs> so much I got a hat. And then we went and did the tide pools. Poor Jax was not feeling it. There was too much nature but they hung in there. And then we were going to pick what food to go to, but Jax really, really wanted to go home. So we're like, okay. So we brought Jax home. We drove all the way back home. It was rush hour traffic, which was stinky, but we made it. Dropped Jax off and we walked out just to a Mexican place that we go to a lot. And I ate like a half of the world's biggest burrito and then rolled myself out the door we stopped at a brewery that sebastian likes because they have all sorts of games so dan said okay you can have the time it takes to drink one beer to play the games so we did that and then he had picked out a new gelato place to go to and they had a couple vegan ones for me to try i got a dark chocolate vegan gelato and then I messaged Jax and asked if they wanted anything so we carried home a milkshake and Danny did it for me because my hands were so cold <laughs> but that's where we are it's like 8 30 ish so I'm gonna curl up until I need to get Sebastian to bed maybe a bath he said something about that but <clears throat> I know it just feels good to be warm <laughs> So it was in sandals and leggings and I was getting quite chilly. But that was our day. Good night, stay safe, be kind, and don't forget, wash your hands.